Hello again, this is Robert Veach here, and this is my video review of a jump starter system by a company called MIUO. You can see right there the logo. This is the nice holder it comes in with a very nice zippered, very nice zippered system right here so that you can keep this in your car ready for use. Everything's all inside this quite nice. You can see the unit right here. We're going to go over all the features and it comes with a very nicely written instruction manual and the jumper cables with a special safety circuit. We're going to go over that and it includes a USB type C port that goes to a standard USB connector and a charger for 120 volts so it's very easy to charge this unit you just plug this in just like that and then you take this part right here and you plug it into a 120 volt port and then you take the unit itself and if you look at the unit the front of it has a LED light it has two USB ports, and I'm going to go over the specs of those. One of them is a Qualcomm 3.0, which is really nice. It has a rubberized cover here, and that's where this jumper port is going to plug into. And then on the side, you have 12-volt DC output if you want to tap off that. And to charge it, you just put the USB Type-C connector in there just like that. And then you have status blinking LEDs right there. And when it's all finished, it'll stop blinking and these will turn off to let you know that it's fully charged. So that's the simple way to charge it. Now let's go over the features of this product so you know how to use it. This is, it has um, 1500 peak amps of energy available for starting your car uh, which is a lot, a lot. Um, you can jump start your SUV your motorcycle your car your ATV lawnmower your boat snowmobile it'll jump start up to an eight liter gas engine which is a really big engine or a six and a half liter diesel engine um, which is pretty impressive it's all ultra safe to use um, with this safety circuit in here I'm going to show this way you don't have to use the traditional jumper method of needing another car, which is really nice. It has protection for overcharging, it has overcurrent protection, short circuit protection, overheat protection, it has two USBs, uh, like I mentioned, one of them is a Qualcomm uh, 3.0, so to quick charge your phone that is uh, Qualcomm spec has 15,000 milliamp hour capacity jump starting capacity in there. It has a built-in emergency flashlight, strobe mode, we're going to show that to an SOS mode. 100% guarantee from the company that's selling this and a full one year warranty. And also there's free tech support with this product. Now some of the some of the specs on this from the from the uh, Amazon page, it has um, 57.72 watt hours and it has 15,600 milliamp hour internal battery in there. And the starter current is 700 amps and the peak starter current as I mentioned is 1500 amps. Um, the output is 12 volts at 6 amps on that port and the output 1 is a Qualcomm 3.0 and that's a variable voltage and current. The output 2 is 5 volts at 2.1 amp. It will fully charge in four hours and these internal batteries will last over 1000 cycles so if you look at this output right here let's go over this again the output one the blue one right there is the Qualcomm 3.0 so you want to charge your Qualcomm compatible cell phones and products and netbooks using that this is a standard uh, USB port 2.1 amps at 5 volts so let's look at this right here. Very sleek looking, very nice. You just hold this power button down right there 
and you see the status that is fully charged. And you can also see that the LED light came on. And it's pretty bright. Now that's the mode where it just comes on constant. Hit it again. That's the SOS mode. And then this mode right here another time is the blinking mode. And then it goes back on to full on. And then it goes cycles through those again. So that's handy. Then you hold it down to shut it off. That's very handy in emergency situations so that you're on the road and you'll be able to alert other cars that are approaching you that you are stopped. So that's nice built right in. Now I'm going to go over how I utilize this and how I uh, put it across my car battery. Um, this is the, the nice quality plus and minus cables that you can see right here. Very nice quality, very high tension on here, very nice solid copper. And this is the connector that's going to mate to this right here. And this is a little safety box that looks at your battery voltage. And it's going to, the manual tells you that it's going to blink and it's going to give you some kind of a status. If you can't get the status to match where you like it, you could always hit this button right here for five seconds and it will reset this and go to green and then you can start your car that way but a lot of times it'll probably go to the normal status of green so you're ready to start without even bypassing it this is a nice safety feature that they implemented into this device now very simply if you open this up right here this port that's got this rubberized piece on there you can see that the port itself has a flat piece and then a round piece and if you look at this right here it has a mating flat piece and a round piece. So this only goes in one way. If you try and put it the other way, it won't work. And right there you can see that it's giving a little blinking status because it, there's no battery connected to it. So we're going to hook this up to my car and we're going to test and see how this works. So I'm going to be following the procedure that's in the manual. So first turn on using the power switch right there and it'll give you a status. In this case it's 100%. Make sure you have at least 25%. Then the manual says to connect the port and on the unit itself you've got your USB ports and your light and you have this port on the side right there and this only goes in one way one side is rectangular and then you see the status led is blinking it's in a wait state waiting for us to connect it to the battery that's the positive terminal so i'm going to put the red on that terminal and this is the negative terminal so i'm going to put the negative on there and it's giving some kind of a blinking status and we're going to hold this down to reset it and now you've got the green light and now we're going to start the car Once the car starts, you want to disconnect your terminals and unplug the adapter and then you're all set and you've started your car. Well, what's my overall impression about the MIUO Jump Starter Portable Battery Booster? I really like this product. Very, very handy, very simple to use. Instructions were very well written. I like this this safety module on here makes this more of a safety device. The fact that it has Qualcomm is very unique. I've never seen that before. Two ports, the LED light with the SOS mode, and just the high-tech looking. And look how small the profile of this is. It's not even heavy or very big. So you could have this in your car and you could charge it just twice a year. You can charge it in the fall and in the spring and you're going to have this in your car ready for some emergency starts and very reliable very safe system so i'm going to give this product a full five star rating on my channel 
please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video content that I upload. I hope this video view helped you with all your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.